Hey everybody, it's Brian House here for Housework and today we are going to be removing the bearing races from the steering neck of a 1991 Harley Davidson Sportster. As you can see, I'm in an extensive rebuild of this bike, having a great time doing it. Inevitably, I do need to replace the bearings and the steering neck, so that's what we're going to be doing today. Uh, this tutorial will apply to a majority of the motorcycles out there on today's market. Uh, you can, you know, pretty much bet that it's going to work for every Harley Davidson out there. So. Anyhow, uh, to get started, we're going to need a few things. I got a uh, two-pound sledge. This is handy. Don't, it's not necessary, but I like having a little extra weight on my hammer. A drift. This is, uh, this is useful. If you don't have this uh, bearing race remover tool that I, I'm using in this tutorial today, uh, there are links down in the description so you can go buy one of these. They're super handy. Uh, they don't just take the races out of steering necks they take the races out of just about any kind of bearing out there so if you have a race that you need to remove this is the guy to get and they're about 40 bucks not too bad and a socket wrench with a half inch socket uh all right so here we go we're just this is going to be straightforward and easy but let's do this all right we got it in there we're tightening it down so as you tighten it the arms spread and I'm going to slide this drift down on top of that bearing race remover and I'm going to tap equally until I'm just going to go even taps on each side. And out she came. Now we have one more to do, so we're going to go ahead and reverse the process on the top. there it is all right there you have it we've got both of our bearing races out of our steering neck uh, the steering neck bearing race remover made that really easy to actually accomplish there are links down in the description so you can buy one on amazon it was about 40 bucks and i used it uh, about three or four times already on this project so it's worth having uh, if you're into motorcycles uh, cars trucks and trailers that is a useful tool to have around uh, as always, if you enjoyed this video, please leave me a like and please subscribe. I'm in the middle of this extensive rebuild on this bike and probably will be doing more. So thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Have an awesome day. Thanks for watching. Check us out on Instagram at house underscore underscore work. That's two underscores between those words. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that subscribe button and leave us a like.